space, a vast expanse that stretches beyond our imagination, filled with countless wonders and mysteries. Among its many enigmas, black holes stand out as some of the most fascinating and perplexing objects in the universe. These celestial objects possess a gravitational pull so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape their grasp. They are the ultimate cosmic traps, a place where the laws of physics as we know them break down, creating a realm of chaos and unpredictability. That is the allure of a black hole. Our understanding of these celestial objects has evolved from theoretical concepts to observable phenomena, allowing us to study them in ways never before possible. Now a new discovery has set the scientific community abuzz. A black hole of unprecedented size and scale has been found, dwarfing all previous discoveries and opening up new avenues of research and exploration. This black hole, named Phoenix A, is so massive that it outweighs our sun by an astounding 100 billion times, making it one of the largest black holes known in the universe. A few years ago, the largest known black hole was Tun 618, with a mass of 40.7 billion suns. However, the discovery of the black hole in the Phoenix Cluster has changed this. The Phoenix Cluster is a heavily studied galaxy cluster with around 1,000 galaxies and an unusually high rate of star formation. It is one of the most massive galaxy clusters known. Picture a star, much larger than our Sun, reaching the end of its life. This star has spent millions of years burning brightly, fusing hydrogen into helium in its core. As its nuclear fuel runs out, it can no longer support its own weight. Gravity takes over and the star begins to collapse under its own immense gravitational force. The star collapses in on itself, compressing its mass into an infinitely small point. This process happens incredibly quickly in a matter of seconds. This point, known as a singularity, is the heart of a black hole. It is a place where the laws of physics as we know them cease to apply. Surrounding the singularity is an invisible boundary known as the event horizon. This boundary is crucial in defining a black hole. This marks the point of no return. Once an object crosses this threshold, it is forever trapped by the black hole's gravity. Once something crosses the event horizon, there's no coming back. It is pulled inexorably towards the singularity. It is inevitably drawn towards the singularity, succumbing to the immense gravitational pull. This process can tear apart stars and planets. Black holes are not cosmic vacuum cleaners, though. They do not roam the universe, indiscriminately devouring everything in their path. They only consume matter and light that venture too close. Anything that stays outside the event horizon remains unaffected by the black hole's pull. Phoenix A, a black hole recently discovered in the distant universe. This celestial giant resides in a galaxy billions of light years from our own. This isn't just any galaxy, it's one of the most active galaxies ever found, producing stars at a remarkable rate. While our Milky Way forms around one star per year, Phoenix A churns out an astounding 740 stars annually. Yet the galaxy's most remarkable feature lies at its core, a supermassive black hole so immense that it ranks among the largest known black holes in the observable universe. Its discovery was the result of years of meticulous observation and analysis by astronomers around the world. Utilizing powerful telescopes both on Earth and in space, scientists detected the telltale signs of a supermassive black hole. The distortion of light, the acceleration of nearby stars, all pointed towards the presence of an object with immense gravity. Phoenix A was no ordinary black hole, however. It was something far grander. What sets Phoenix A apart is its sheer size. It has a history of betraying galaxies for mass and is likely plotting to do the same to its own galaxy. It dwarfs previously known black holes. The event horizon of this black hole spans billion of kilometers about 100 times the distance from the Sun to Pluto. Imagine our solar system, with all its planets and asteroids, contained within a region smaller than the orbit of Mercury. That's the kind of gravitational dominance we're talking about. Phoenix A's sheer size suggests it couldn't have originated from a star. Typical black holes are born from the collapse of massive stars, but Phoenix A's immense size makes it highly unlikely to have originated from a single stellar collapse. 
Current models of black hole formation struggle to explain how Phoenix A could have grown so large in such a short amount of time. It could have been formed from the collision of multiple supermassive black holes. One hypothesis posits that Phoenix A might be a primordial black hole, one of the first that formed shortly after the Big Bang. The first stars in the universe were likely much more massive than those we see today, resulting in larger black holes when they collapsed. If those black holes subsequently merged, they could have produced something as massive as Phoenix A. However, this remains a theory and scientists continue to explore possibilities as they try to unravel the formation of such a behemoth. Observing a black hole directly is impossible. These enigmatic objects are shrouded in mystery, hidden from our view. However, astronomers can study the effects of a black hole on its surroundings. The dance of stars and the movement of gas clouds offer vital clues. By analyzing the motion of stars and gas clouds caught in its gravitational web, we can infer its presence and properties. This indirect observation is our window into the abyss. Phoenix A is no exception. This colossal black hole lies at the center of its galaxy, influencing everything around it. It is surrounded by a swirling disk of superheated gas and dust, known as an accretion disk. This disk is a chaotic, luminous beacon in the darkness. As material spirals inwards towards the event horizon, it is heated to millions of degrees, emitting intense radiation that we can detect here on Earth. This radiation is a telltale sign of the black hole's voracious appetite. These emissions provide valuable clues about the black hole's mass, spin and even its history. By studying these signals, we can piece together the life story of these cosmic giants, understanding their formation and evolution over billions of years. Phoenix a black hole continues to grow, voraciously consuming vast amounts of surrounding material and gaining an estimated 60 solar masses every year. The discovery of Phoenix A has significant implications for our understanding of the early universe. Its existence so early in cosmic history suggests that supermassive black holes can form much faster than previously thought. This challenges existing theories about black hole formation and growth. Furthermore, Phoenix A's size and mass provide insights into the conditions present in the early universe. It suggests that the early universe was a much more chaotic and energetic place than we once believed. Studying such objects can help us piece together the events that transpired in the universe's infancy.